Hey guys, this is Camilio and welcome to the Ritual Gaming Junction. We're playing Deus Ex. Uh, we were just about to enter the like secret facility that's inside the apartment. That takes a big chunk of this building. But I uh, just want to be sure that I check the computer and explore the rest of the apartment. Essentially, where we're at here is we've got two faction, two triads faction, the luminous path and the red arrow. And the red arrow had a nano nano cut sword or something like that. That's incredibly powerful. Too heavy to lift. <coughs> And uh, got stolen by Miss Chow, uh, but she blamed the Luminous Path, so they both uh, decided to go at war against each other. And I guess she's laughing to the bank or something, I don't know. But she has the sword here, we'll get to it. So we did that. Oh, it wasn't computer, it was just a. <laughs> I thought this was a light switch. Isn't there a computer somewhere? Maybe not. Okay, let's do this. I guess if you don't know that you can do this, you will have to enter by another place and might be more difficult. Because entering here means you just pop right at the where you need to be. And this door is even open. Greetings, JC Tim. I have been observing you through this fascinating device in your skull. You have found the proof we needed. The Dragon's Tooth Sword. There, inside the glass case. If you wish to be my ally, you will retrieve the sword and await my instructions. Which I'm pretty sure is the only way to progress in the game. It looks as though they... Oops. Oh, the saving even goes faster. Oh, I finally found a way to... Like, I can enter my... My settings and press escape and... The F keys. What I have to... Having to wait like 10 seconds each time. It was essentially to put it full screen. <coughs> The problem when, when it put full screen, usually it just shut down my secondary monitor for some reason. But you just try it out a couple of times, and one time out of ten, the screen will stay up and I can see my chat and stuff like that. So, the weapon case. Ah, oh, there were emails, but I won't be able to check the emails because I'm an ass. Oh, there's a password, I guess. No, you took the sword, Yen. You took it from the wrong place and the wrong people, and now you're in pain. You know how much I hate to see you in. Okay. Good. Now take the sword to Max Chin at the Lucky Money Club. If you can make peace among the triads, then perhaps I can help you in your difficulties. <laughs> Excellent. So MC is Maggie Chin. I am the dragon of the red red arrow triad and you are a hollow woman. I'm much more than that, Yen. I'm the only thing standing between you and the world of hurt and darkness and shame. Tell me where the sword is and maybe you'll die soon. And you, you are a bad actress. Unknown sound. And you have one less finger. Okay. Wuchak! Inter really? Interesting. There's a bunch of renderers you can try. <clears throat> Um, for me, all of them worked, but there one there was one that just the lighting was better. It was just overall better. Uh, but you can try OpenGL, DirectX. Um, if you don't know DG, D, DJ, DG, DG, yeah, G like generation. DG Voodoo can also help. 
And then there's the streaming part. Sometimes the streaming part can also be a problem. <laughs> Running the game is a one-step process, and then streaming and sometimes it's a uh-oh, the game doesn't stream or something. You don't have enough room in your inventory to pick up the dragon to the sword. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll have to use some of these, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna use the regeneration, I'm sure. I think I'm gonna flush this. I definitely can flush, whoops, the flush this. And I'm gonna put it at the top there. Oh, there's some inventory management to do here. There you go. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Something like that. Okay, I am fully equipped. It ran fine, but I'm streaming from the same PC. Yeah, I'm also streaming from the same PC, with, which can be a problem. I was having trouble being in the window mode. Just need to take a look back. Oh, yeah, you'll figure it out. You can try it in, in windowed, and if, uh, if windowed... I usually play all my games in windowed mode. It, it's just so much less asshole. And usually I don't even play them at 1080p. Because I want to have the chat in the same window. Because I just I'm too lazy to look at the... <laughs> chat there. Uh, I just wanted to have it there and not having like to do this and stuff like that and But for this game in particular I had some problems because the HUD Was kind of all over the place. It wasn't the right size. It looked like crap So I wanted to look like this And I'm all happy. I finally have the setup that I want and then when I press F1 I, I don't have to, to wait like 10 seconds Ms. Chow, we are reassigning you temporarily. Put the long-term agenda on hold until Versa Life has met its deadline. It will be months and probably years before the Red Arrow can influence Beijing, whereas, well, I'm sure you heard about my appointment. We are in position to make a grab for Washington. We can't let this one slip through our fingers. Make sure the process stays on schedule. Oh, uh, you need also, you should run, uh, I don't know what the name of the guy is, like, Tank. Tenkis or Tekenshi or something like that. Um, search direct um, Deazex setup, and it's like a launcher which will help you with the FOV, um, other stuff like that. Melia has assigned me the peacekeeping occupation of this stream. Okay, no problem. <laughs> <coughs> oh yeah, and. Uh, th that will also be fixed with the the setup, the the HUD. You can do a times two HUD, because the the HUD essentially will be just will be scaled with your resolution. But sometimes it's so small on bigger resolution that now now you can times two it, so it 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 bumps out at two. So this is times two, so it's just perfect. This is just perfect. This the guy at the top left is just so big, because back when I played, I think the first play, time I played this, it must have must have been in 640 by 480, and that bar at the bottom, the dragon to the key ring, would take the whole, the whole bottom of the screen, and would almost touch the, the bar at the right. Everything would touch it, like. It was all cramped up when there was a, a dialogue window at the top. It was all like because there was it was a white screen, of course. Whoever's out there, oh. give yourself. Oh yeah. Okay, I, I think I saved. Yeah, maybe after. Ms. Uh, Chow, we are reassigning you temporarily. 
put the long-term agenda on hold until Versa okay, life has met its deadline. Put this in some it will be months order. and probably years before the Red Arrow can influence Beijing. Whereas, well, I'm sure you heard about my appointment. I should put we are in this position here. to make a grab for Washington. This is what I we use. We can't let most. this one slip through our fingers. Make sure the process stays on schedule. And then this at the end, since I can use it, but I don't really use it. I will. <laughs> Like I said before, there's no real reason to keep this, but okay, I'm gonna keep it for a little while. Sergeant, oh, is that you? shit. I could have sworn. <laughs> Can you believe it? It's just, just we are reassigning you temporarily. Put the long-term agenda on hold until Versa Life has met its deadline. It will be months and probably years before the Red Arrow can influence Beijing. Whereas, well, I'm sure you heard of. Wow! <laughs> There's a bunch of dude there. Check it out. I am the ultimate badass. Yeah. State of the badass art. You do not want to fuck with me. You need to play this game, Wuchunk. Put Wuchunk. Put. Put the effort. You need. To. It's a must play for anyone that's interested in that kind of game. It's not for everyone, but neither is Mario or any Getting game. too old for this. You're too old for this. Should I just... Uh, oh my god, three grenades. That's not much. Okay, let's, let's power up our guy. Activate... That's about it. That's about it. Oh yeah. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. Oh. The need to go here. My gamer, my gamer, my inner gamer, I don't know, wanted, needed to go here. Needed to do that. Lockpick. I can just bash this in. Oh. Really? I'm surprised. Usually that sword just bash through anything. Uh, maybe if I upgrade it? Yeah, let's upgrade it. I'm gonna save, upgrade it, because I didn't want to upgrade it at level 3. I don't think I need it. Level 6. No, it doesn't do anything, so let's not do that. I can also upgrade my skills here. Not right now. So let's uh, just use these lockpicks. But yeah, with that sword you can bash pretty much anything. Thanks for the holes, by the way, Michael. I type in um, running the ASX on Windows um, 7 or 10, whatever Windows you're using. In Google, and you'll find a couple of, of like uh, forums or uh, stuff like that. And Steam forums, God forums. They'll tell you like step by step uh, what to do. Oh, I did all this. Is this hmm. not for now? 
up or down? Let's go up. That's just the rooftops. We, we went there. There was nothing. Well, that was weird. Oh, yeah. Play the other Deus Ex, the newer ones. Human Revolution is a great game, really. It really stands stands up to uh, to its predecessor. Third installment. Okay, yeah, you played the the, the other better one. <laughs> Human Revolution, yeah. The first of the new, like the second wave, I'd say. Um, what's the code for this? Pretty sure I have it somewhere around here. right here like three four 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 oh that's why it's not in my notes I was so you could enter it by uh, lockpicking this. Could I dash this? Yeah, yeah, it dashes pretty much everything. I'm surprised it didn't bash that thing, but I guess the, the developers didn't want us to bash everything in the game. <laughs> and I think she can help you us. You have with something. 20 credits, mister. What for? 20. I will be honest, it is crash. A big crash. Uh, I just need a little for the pain. <laughs> Let's kick the habit. Hey, you're this far into withdrawal. Maybe it's time you kick the habit. <laughs> How can you? Why Fuck so you. cruel? Fuck you. It's for your own good. You awful man. I hope you die very soon. <laughs> I knew she was really pissed. <laughs> I hope you die very soon. Yeah, well, I hope you die very soon. <laughs> and that's pretty much it. I thought there was more of it. <laughs> You're an awful man. Welcome to Queen's Tower. Bye bye. I myself have been watching Miss Chow. She just so, met with Max yeah, Chen, cool. leader of the Red Arrow. Okay, we could go back to the lucky money to uh, 
I'm gonna do one thing first. The canal, we can go back to the canal. Canal road. Yeah. We're gonna bash some skulls. Very casual reading. Yeah, the tattoos. <laughs> yep, yep. That's how it is. That's the the game's way to um, to show you uh, how much sound you make. So it yeah, it can be annoying. I usually don't talk about it because if you, most people don't notice it because uh, I don't know. So if you notice this, you're <laughs> you're one of them. <laughs> I noticed it. I I was. First time I installed it, I was fiddling with the options. I always do that because I'm like, oh, that was—it's not normal. It's just crazy loud. Why is it loud like that? <laughs> with my and I had a kind of weird uh, speaker setup, and for some reason it was even louder. Okay, they're gonna bash. Uh, they're gonna attack a bunch of uh, yeah. You can watch them. We won't take part in that fight. There's some stuff to do here. Oh! The luminous path has prevailed. Uh, yes, but no, no, uh, no, uh, silent movement. Yes, but no, no, silent movement is a, an augmentation, so you will never put it always on. It's just for us. Nothing to see here. Move along. Lock it. Sword. Has that suit. Some exploration bonus. <laughs> I thought it would say too heavy. Imagine. Imagine that. <laughs> hey guys. Can I exit this? None of your concern. None of your concern. The sword, the sword, the sword, the sword, the sword. The sword. We are now one spectators. Eh, I thought there was more here. Oh, there's this. We're no, we're not done. There's another thing we need to do. We're not done with Hong Kong. The Rocky Money. I'm sure there's gonna be a fight here. I remember fighting in those corridors. <laughs> it always depends on what you do, but. Uh, Thanks for getting me in. Hello. Thanks for getting me in. Let's do a real save here. Oh my god, so. It feels so good to be able to enter that menu really quickly. Isaac is the one nothing to do with Guilos. Yeah, by the way, Guilos and say your like business and go. The N word of it's not necessarily the N word, but it's it's a term for foreigners in the Eastern countries. Let's talk to you. I have your sword, dude. I have found something in Miss Chow's apartment that might interest you. Is that so? The sword was never destroyed. It was stolen, and she is the one who stole it. Preposterous! I have it right here. But, Miss Chow? She works for a group called Majestic 12. She's using you and the Red Arrow for her own ends. No, 
You must be mistaken. Think about it. She murders your predecessor, hides the sword, pushes the red arrow into the war with the luminous path, and then what next? The triads are weakened and an outside group seizes power. Sound far-fetched? Oh, there must be an explanation. Perhaps you should meet with the leaders of the luminous path. Hmm, perhaps. For now, I'll take them this message. I will stop hostilities until I have completed an investigation. Boss, what is it? Marty at the door so we have trouble. So just coming in. She said I was some kind of max. MJ-12 troops. They must have followed me. Uh-oh. There you go. Time for you to go! I need to access this computer also. Oh. Ah. They can fight. Time for you to go! You led them here. You should have been more careful. I'm gonna check this computer. Max, we have been friends since we were children, so I hope you will not find any disrespect in what I am about to say. But first, I must express again my great sorrow of the bit of the end, because... If you know... Okay, I might have read that. I know one thing I forgot to read is... Ooh, oh, these guys. These are MJ-12 Commando. You will see a lot of these guys. That's why the sword will be useful. Get out, get out. The AI in this game might seem derpy, but people react to what's going on. Oh my god. I thought it was about to turn around. My ammo is dwindling quite fast. They're fighting the police. Uh oh. Oh, there goes the leader. Oh, oh I, I, he was a friend. Uh, I don't know if that was important, that that guy needed to live, but now he's dead. shit about the alarm. Right? Can I use the sword? Okay, no, that was just hidden with the bars. Okay. Oh. Oh, uh, that might be because of the alarm here. It's the police, I think, is supposed to be on my side. Okay, he's okay, but he's not okay. Might be done with this. Let's go. <laughs> nice lightsaber. Oh yes, the dragon tooth. This will be my main weapon. M not my main weapon, but it will be one of my main weapons for the rest of the game. My own business. Go 
away. You were right. Maggie Chow is a con artist. You have proof. Yes, I found the sword in her apartment. Good. Inform the Red Arrow Dragonhead. Then we will see who is the real traitor. I've already been to the Lucky Money. Max Chen has declared a truce between the Red Arrow and the Luminous Path. A truce? Are you certain? Majestic 12 attacked the club. I think he would consider forming an alliance. Mr. Denton, you are the man I hoped you were. Is the Trace of Tong is inside, in his laboratory below the compound. The door is in our sparring room. He will know what to do next. To enter our compound, use the code 1997. That sounds like the 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 date of the foundation of Iron Storm or something. While you are here, observe the laws of the triad. It's definitely a date, 1997. Do not interrupt us with pressure. People are friendly here. I'm already. I'm. I'm on the, the edge. Uh, like somebody's gonna shoot me. You guys, you guys. Check it out. I am the ultimate badass. Yeah. State of the badass art. You do not want to fuck on me. The SX doesn't, doesn't break. I have tried a lot of things to, but I'm sure speedrunners break that game like there's nothing, but not really. It's a game that's really, it's, it's complex, but at the same time, it's quite simple what you do. Like people can die and it feels alive. Like that Maggie Chow, I could have shot her in the head. Doesn't matter. The game will continue on bunch of guys who can just shoot. And there's X2, uh, there's a couple of characters that that can't die, that the, the game doesn't want you to kill them, so you see them behind glasses, bulletproof glasses and stuff like that. So. Game over man, game over. Oh if you want game over man, game over is like 8 bits or something. You check in the bits section, it's 8 or 9 bits I think. <laughs> if you want to hear that, I'm a big fan of that game, uh, that game, <laughs> that movie, and uh, a, a bunch of other movies also. I'm a movie, uh, <laughs> movie fanatic. I don't know. <laughs> I watch too many movies. That's it, man. Game over, man. Game over. There you go. You must have won great favor with the dragon head. <laughs> hey, Leisure Gaming! How are you doing, man? Ah, there's nothing here. We have to get to the countdown. Trace of Taunt admitted another American. Perhaps you know him. Oh, it's so dark. We will check with the dragon head about whether you can. <laughs> I'll pop up the camera. That's like it's super. Uh, it seems super bright, but when you come back here, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. If Tom decides he trusts uh, you, you'll be free right, to right. come and go as you please. It is a dark game. Yeah, let's go with that. Uh, so did we check the... I'm sure they gave us a... What's here? Teton. Nobody has anything, what? Watch yourself in the market. We have lost influence there. Okay, so... I 
Are you expecting a tour? Yeah, ma. Do yeah, not linger in the tour. compound. Where's the door to the... Oh, it's here? Yeah. Okay. Uh, there's nothing else. Ah, they're like treating me like the... <laughs> the fine game that it is. Always good nights with the ASX. Your business is with Treasure. This is pretty much my favorite game of all time. This is System Shock 2. You will be permitted to go above. This is 1997 again. Journal of the of Gordon Quick. It is the steel in my heart, much like that of our of her father, that leads me to love her. How unfortunate that the old god should laugh and she should be the child of the dragon head of their dragon head. The man who would lead the red arrow against the luminous path and destroy all we have sought to create for the celestial kingdom. But I know that whatever fate has this creed for us, we will walk that road together. There can be no betrayal in the feelings we have for each other, and no teaching that can show me the error in our actions. <laughs> the master tongue has informed me that we will have visitors. BJC, Tom will see you now. That's it. Mr. Tong, you know my brother Paul Dennis. Mr. Tong. Yes, a reliable man. So your kill switch has been activated. I feel fine, but it's been over 16 hours. See how easily our technologies turn on us? The more power you think you have, the more quickly it slips from your hands. Can you do something about it? That will depend. You, like your brother, are an extraordinary piece of technology. I never pass up the chance to try a new blade, but I fear at the crucial moment, I may lift up my arm to strike and you will twist free of my grasp. In other words, I'll owe you a favor. Indeed, as will your friend Mr. Jacobson, a man of much useful knowledge. He arrived in Hong Kong shortly after you did. I was forced to keep him in custody until I could verify his identity and his loyalties. I assume he checked out. I believe he is sincere. Now, go down the stairs to the operating platform, and I will examine your systems. Yeah, space, I think he's onto something. 1997 was the year British ended Hong Kong back to back to China? I'm still lost and take this off this open in 1997. Yeah, that's what I thought, the foundation of Iron Storm. But it works both ways. Who knows, we would have to ask like... Tom Hall or something. Coincidence? Illuminati! There's a lot of Illuminati in this game. Well, I've got your account all set up and... Yeah, what's... I have my password for this. This is my computer. It must be here. Thoughts and application. As the most unified of the Celestial Lumina is quickly according to the nature of the Nintendo and the so-called Project The Book, where it quickly declined in an extremely abrupt manner. Music sounds a little I spill loud. my drink. Yeah, I don't know why. It's kind of aggressive. It's great the music, but it's kind of too much. 
As the most dignified of the celestial kingdom as, as expected, inquiries into the nature of MJ-12 and the so-called Project D-Book were quickly declined in an extremely abrupt manner and resulted in the unfortunate but necessarily a necessary loss of one humble servant who will be forever exalted in the annals of our organization. However, further perseverance has suggested that the aforementioned project involved a quiet acquisition of Chinese technology and was later applied to the invention of an improved stealth helicopter for use in covered MJ-12 operations. A careful examination <laughs> Examination of electronic traces would lead an astute observer to conclude that this information was liberated during the number a number of skilled intrusion into Chinese corporate data wells were. Okay. Recent human trials and subsequent mortality studies have demonstrated that nano augmentation of baseline human psychology is not without hazards. Notably, key anatomic regions can support only limited augmentation without risking rejection or accelerated, accelerated de degeneration. Research is ongoing, but current data suggests that following nano augmentation combination have accepted risk. So that's all the nano augmentation in the game. Uh, they will appear in my uh, in my notes here. Oh, I guess I I picked that up earlier. So it's it's somewhere somewhere. Sorry, I don't have my password. Did you give it to me? <laughs> he didn't, so let's hack it. It might not be my... my uh, I thought it was mine. Maybe not. Uh, it's Alex to JC Denton. It is mine. Well, I've got your account all set up and you should be ready to go with the communication. Alex. What's my password? I'm sure someone's gonna tell me. risk following me here. Thanks. When you believe in something, you've just gotta do it. How'd you find Tong so quickly? Turns out I knew him all along. TT undernet.0924.243.886. <laughs> I posted a message to the board and contacted me himself. You talked to Jaime before you left? He told me you wanted to use him as a spy. I don't know. Pretty dangerous, isn't it? Maybe. What do you think? Jaime was scared. Simons is on a witch hunt for traitors. They probably suspect him because we're friends. Exactly. But he told me he's going to stick it out because you think it'll help. Hmm. I hope he's smart enough to know when to get out. Did you ever dig up anything about this Daedalus character? I'm still hearing from him. Actually, I did, sort of. Crypto says Daedalus was supposedly a government AI project, also known as Echelon 4. Supposedly? Getting this from anonymous crypto boards. Daedalus was supposed to be the old content recognition problem in surveillance. It was a program that could search all the terabytes of intercepted messages for subversive content. So, what happened? Never panned out as far as I know. The problem was just too hard. They blew through a lot of taxpayer money, but finally had to scrap the whole project. So the thing that's talking in my head is, what, uh, resurrected AI? I wish I knew. Tong has <laughs> connections. You should scope out the labs for upgrades. I'm I sure Jaime will be password. fine. Please, complete your business and then go. Oh, I 
二十级无所谓Is in the operating theater. Do not tell anyone how to get to this facility. Another one. I have two already. I think I'm good. Where's Tony again? The operation. Your friend Alex Jacobson is here. I think he is examining Tong's equipment. Just step inside the chamber. Eh? He wants me to go. There. Just step inside the chamber. Let's try that. <laughs> I was right there a second ago. Okay, I wasn't on the spot. Stay right there. Okay. Bobadino, Mr. J.C. Denton in the fresh. <laughs> yeah, this is like the worst Chinese accent ever in this whole area. It's almost offensive to the Chinese people. Come back to the control room. Success. Oh, I could use that. So, your friend stole a black helicopter? No, no, no. <laughs> That's it? A simple switch, as they call it. Have you heard from Paul? On his way, according to Smuggler in New York. He will be fine. Meanwhile, we still face the likelihood of a triad war here in Hong Kong. Quick and Chen declared a truce just a few minutes ago. A good bit of diplomacy, I admit. But it won't hold. Not with the sword left to be fought over. I think they will be slow to anger with Maggie Chow out of the picture. No. In their system, the sword is a doomsday weapon, a temptation. We must recover the ramen coating from VersaLife and make it available to both triads. So that's all you expect in the way of a favor? A little corporate espionage? The first of many favors. Remember, I saved your life. Now pay attention. The VersaLife elevator north of the market will require an employee number. Try 06288. Once inside, find Mr. Hundley, the shift supervisor. He can be persuaded to give you access to the labs. Hundley. You will find him receptive. He is the corrupt official who sold the Red Arrow the technology to begin with. I'll find the ramen coating, but I'm not your henchman. Scared I'll help you as long as we have a mutual interest. If you choose to fight Majestic 12, you will need an ally. We will have a mutual interest for some time. In fact, I took the liberty of setting up a computer account for you. Okay. Log in JC Denton. Password, Sanctuary. Feel free to use the machine in my office. We have much to offer one another if we cooperate. No, no, Paul's not there. We need Paul. You... I wish he would hurry up. 
Yeah, exactly. He's coming. Your friend from Unatco is very knowledgeable about I do remember networks. Paul being he will be very very useful. right uh, somewhere. It might be after I come back from Versalife. I've wanted to learn more about Versalife for Paul a long time. Paul is not dead. He's not supposed to be dead. I talked to him uh, when we escaped from Versalife. From Versalife? No, from the United headquarters. I went to him, talked to him, he said, I'll be fine, do your thing. Blah, blah, blah. Same thing as I always do, like I played this game many times. It should be okay. He just said both. As play. you know, Versalife manufactures ambrosia. Like, as you said that. More when you return. Go, Go now. Go now. We need But it's okay. That, that I wish he would hurry up. That's the only one that has it. We have okay, much to offer one over. another if we cooperate. We have much to offer one another if we cooperate. As you know, oh, okay, okay. Versa Life manufactures. He's not talking about uh, Paul anymore. So, yeah. No, I have to. JC Denton. JC Denton. Sanctuary. But Paul doesn't really do anything. That's one of the things that's kind of lame. <laughs> he just sits there and doesn't uh, give you something or because Jamie if if he would have went with us uh, he would give us a upgrade a canister I think but now he's gonna give us uh, uh, something else I'm gonna, not gonna say. Well I've got your account all set up blah 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 you know find yourself out of time for in case seems like a dream coming in a time which we want. Okay, Davis. There is little time you should know that the organization for which you have worked, whose goals and interests you believe to be your own, is not what it is, what it seems. Natco is merely an arm of a larger entity known as Majestic, Majestic 12. And Majestic 12 is also just an arm for another organization. Majestic 12 seeks to use force and intimidation to seize absolute control of everything. They will not hesitate to use all means necessary to achieve this goal and have engineered the disease you refer to as the Great Death in an effort to accomplish this. They must not be allowed to succeed. Your brother has been an aid to me in this matter, but cannot help me any longer. He must take his place. The Great Death is a nanotechnologically engineered virus. You are immune, but others are not. You must locate the universal constructor used to create the Great Death and destroy it. My information indicates that it is in an Hong Kong house in the Majestic 12 facility beneath the corporation known as First Life. You must not fail. S. Carter. They'd fire me on the spot if they knew I was sending you this message. There were 12 government officials brought in the Roswell early crash and they were later called the Majestic 12. Yes, I know all of them. <laughs> I'm really big into conspiracy stuff. Uh, uh, like I watched a, a lot of X Files, and when internet became became more, um, and before that I watched uh, a couple of shows like uh, Sightings and stuff like that. So I was really like, oh, I, I love the digging stuff up about like aliens and the pyramids and all that stuff. So when that game came out, I was like, oh my god, this is the game for me. Like the old Illuminati and the Area 51 and all that shit. <clears throat> it's like all the conspiration in, in, in one game, it all really makes sense uh, in the game. I understand why you did it, because a soldier, so he's, he's saying that, uh, sort of just piece of chess board. Things been bad since you left, Madhuri has disappeared, I say he's been relieved of duty, I killed him. The director of FEMA, Walter Simmons, has assumed interim authority, but there's something about him I don't like. He seems reasonable, but there's something about his eyes. I saw the same look on men in combat when all the part of them that was human just left. I have some friends who used to be associated with Unatco. They've disappeared. Let me see if I can find them again. Maybe they'll be useful to you. We'll see. In the meantime, do what you think is right, JC, and let the devil take the rest. So Sam Carter was the guy at the uh, armory that we gave like guns and stuff. Okay, let's hack into uh, Versa Life. All the conspiracies. But as a kid, well, I wasn't really a kid when While I played this. Here, mm -hmm. I'm, old. The I'm, of the 
I'm still a kid. <laughs> Always a kid. And I was like, oh, that's so cool. You must have won great favor with the dragon head. <laughs> it was the same feeling when I play when I play the uh, especially the, the third Gabriel Knight game. Trace of Ton admitted another American. It, it touches onto the same stuff that's in the, the Da Vinci Code, but before the Da Vinci Code. So, and you kind of solve the thing yourself. It's kind of really involved. And I really liked it. I was like, hey, you can do that. You can put stuff like that in your game. What? Uh, we just need to go to the Versa Life building, which is right hmm. over here. Code is 06288. 06288. That's that's the whole the whole security they 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 have. And this is like 2050 uh, something uh, up, I guess. Personal Life Corporation data entry facility. If you need help, talk to one of the receptionists. Okay. You do not require a security pass to visit the first three levels of offices. Is he talking to me? I think he was talking to me uh, through the window, the glass, <laughs> which I'm not supposed to know. Late night. Uh, it's not supposed to know, but you have a, a viewpoint right Welcome there. Welcome right? to Versaline. We make tomorrow look like yesterday. How can I help you? I'm looking for Mr. Hundley. He's upstairs making his rounds. Look for a man in a black suit. Thank you. I can hide this. Yeah, do that. <laughs> I like to have your employee about you, but so. We're all out of company brochures. Go on up. <laughs> yeah, some people might die. Please address inquiries to my supervisor. I try not to kill them. But if they get in my way... Oof, I recently heard some negative discussion that was a risk of life. It's a war, a war against disease and poverty. If we're not willing to reach out and support our neighbor in the cubicle look for, across from us in the foxhole and something, something. Uh, there's a couple of things here if you really search carefully. Some bio cells, stuff like Please that. Please stay out of the work area. I have work to do. I have work to do. I'm sure you do. I would usually hack all of these computers to be sure that there's not one that's something special. Not today. That, that's for you guys. I'm not gonna. I can't be bothered. <laughs> okay, that's it. There's not much. It's a big area. Um, you miss the psionics people. My feet are killing me. They say I feel like killing. Oh, there's an upgrade there. I like. I'd like to pick it up. You work with psionics? You look like you could have a uh, gift. I think. Yeah, maybe on the way out, everybody's hostile. So. Yeah. I can talk to one guy around here.
Not much around here. Holy shit, I thought there was something. But there's three level of this. Oh yeah, honor, duty, loyalty, respect, trust, obey of course. <laughs> oh, this guy. Mr. Hundley, shift supervisor. Who might you be? I'm contracting this month. Quite a facility you have here. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yes, we're pretty proud of the work we're doing. Any chance I could get a tour of the labs? Oh, no, I'm afraid not. Uh, trade secrets and all that. Yeah, yeah. I'll make it worth your while. Hmm. To the tune of what? Oh, no. 2,000? <laughs> Never mind. When corrupt, when you corrupt, you corrupt to the bone. Those signs will be thing will be a thing after too long. Those signs? What do you mean? Oh yeah, those signs, the obey thing. <laughs> and if you've never saw the movie They Live, please see the movie They Live. So much for the and schedule, also, right, mate? The schedule. Yeah, sure. It's swell to miss a day of work, but they bloody hell better push back the delivery. I know I won't be done. They'll understand. At least the super freighter's on our way to America. No more special agents nosing about up here. Special agents? You know, the ones in the suits with grey skin. Eyes tattooed on the backs of their necks. I'd sure like to know what was in those tanks to make them so uptight. <laughs> Didn't get a jot of work done today. Yeah, it's a John Carpenter movie, so it's not crap. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'll play all the DSS games. It's my favorite game of all time. And I, I love all the series except like the last one, which is just forgettable as shit. So I don't think I'll play that one. I can definitely not... Uh, I don't have to put it in my head cannon. Like, it doesn't belong for me. Like you can jump from Human Revolution to this and it makes perfect sense. You don't have to play it. They were bright enough to not rely on the fact that they might have a sequel. Which is a shame when, when games like are so pretentious that they think that oh we'll we'll get our sequel, so we don't have to resolve anything, we'll just half ass it. <laughs> what? Just looking around. People are trying to concentrate. Not on stream. They keep oh, you up I've here played them a bunch. I That's mean. because I don't <laughs> want people looking over my shoulder. Why not? Huh. I guess it doesn't matter what I say anymore. It's because I falsify all the records, okay? They probably don't want you telling people that. So? I don't care. I figured it out today, how they do it. People with my job got the great death. In a couple of weeks, I could be in a camp. I could already be sick. Why would they do that? Whatever's in those labs, stuff goes in there. Instruments, military personnel, none of it goes on the record. Iverson had this job, that's why he got sick. Chang, Kylie, Watts, now it's me. I'd really like to check out those labs. You some kind of spy or something? something. Does it matter? <laughs> if I get you down something. there, can you do something for me? What's that? Hunley, kill him. I bet you could do it. You guys have ways to keep from getting caught. I can give you clearance. I can do that. I want to see those lads. Mr. Hunley checks the logs every five minutes. I can't do anything. Okay. Obey, duty, honor, respect, trust. Subtle sign. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah, I... Mankind Divided is just not good. I... I bought it thinking that would be... Maybe not as good as Human Revolution, but the first time I played Re Human Revolution, believe it or not, I liked it, but there was a bunch of things that I, did, that I didn't like because it was different from the other ones. But some things were dumb down. There always are. This game has everything. Like, what game has inventory space like that uh, where you put things that on top of multiple... Uh, uh, sort of ammos on every gun there's about like maybe 15 to 20 gun in this game 
uh, upgrades, rebreather, uh, skills, augmentation, your health on every part. You have note here from the start of the game. Uh, I can add a note if I want to. Uh, I, I can modify any note here if I want to. Uh, I have images here. Uh, some of them are maps. I can put a note everywhere that I want to. Uh, this is a list of all the conversation in the freaking game. This is logs of every... I mean, what the f... And why? Why is that game has that and no fucking other game has it? Is it that hard? I don't think so. It's just laziness, I think. Yeah, and everybody loves the Tetris in the tour. <laughs> the AI isn't really that good in this game either. When I played when I played Human Revolution, I felt it was derpy and I felt this is Deus Ex. <laughs> um I guess I can't go there. Yeah, he's gonna give me the code, right? This is the RC I security. Have you tried the GMDX mod for this? It improves the AI. Uh, I, I I played a couple of of mods back in the day. Uh, it's been a while. Uh, I didn't want to. I wanted to play the va vanilla game. Um, I I might play GMDX eventually. This Kremlin receptor patent proposal is kicking my ass. But the, the AI, people are like, oh, the AI is dumb. It's not dumb, it's just when you... You'll see it's not dumb. It takes cover, it moves around. If if it sees that I, I'm targeting him in the head or something, he's gonna... If he's crunched and I'm, I'm targeting him in the head or something, he's gonna move around. Um, the, the thing is, when they're about halfway done in their health, um, they just drop their gun or they freak out and go away. Which makes for really, really derpy fights. They tried to make it real. The whole point of this game was trying to make it as realistic as possible. That's why you have all these things. And it makes sense in the world of the game because uh, the guy has a computer in the head, so he has the conversation skills and not the skills maybe, but all that is in his head. <laughs> like my HUD here. Uh, uh, the guy, where is the guy? He's, he's walking around. The guy in the suit. Yeah, he's right there, so I can just kill him. I'll just snipe him. Just funny. Oh. Two bullets. That's a tough guy. You remember, you could sound the alarm, hide in a duck, and shoot everyone in the room from behind with an opening in the duck. Yeah, exactly like in this game. Exactly. That's, that's Deus Ex. By the way, you can do that in any game. When Half-Life 2 came out, people showed exactly that. That you could just go in crowd space and just shoot everyone. Uh, because some people were saying the AI in Half-Life 2 is like... Ah. No, it wasn't. Like, real good AI. I haven't seen really good AI ever. <laughs> the best AI that like felt. Oh, I need to go talk to that guy. That felt great uh, was um, fear. It wasn't particularly like incredible, but it felt incredible. Uh, people moved realistically, try to flank you, and that's the AI that felt the best in my like. Yeah, the old fear. Yeah. After that, after that game, uh, 
at that moment in time, games were really, really being consoleized and be, be able to port them to PlayStation 2 and Xbox. So AI really took a backseat, and they didn't even talk about it. Like the last game that I heard talking about AI, it was big back in the day. It was Fear and Call of Duty 3, which I I think might might have good AI. But after that, it was like like. Uh, Call of Duty Modern Assault AI, who gives a shit, we have multiplayer. Once game had multiplayer and multiplayer came, became the main focus of the games, who gives a shit about AI, who gives a shit about the, the story campaign, the story. Now AI has ca came back with games like Bioshock, uh, Dishonored and other first person immersive kind of game with stealth and then not just run and gun like Doom. Yeah, Fear has awesome AI. It's not awesome. It's not. I'm sure somebody could come in and say, no, no, it's not. But it's. They did the right thing with the AI that makes it feel great. Same thing. Somebody. Uh, I, I saw an interview with somebody that worked at Half Life on the AI of the, the soldiers, and he explained the AI of the soldiers, and he said they really weren't that smart. But they looked smart, and that's the important thing. The important thing is what the player experience. You could have the most, the, the best AI in the world, and I think the AI in Deus Ex might be even like better or more advanced than it, it should be. And because of that, it feels derpy and doesn't feel right. Because we only see the product of that AI. If we saw everything that that the, the guy thinks when I shoot at him, when I, if I take my sword out and I just shoot the guy, he's gonna, uh, oh! The AI decided to just stay there and die. <laughs> Let's see, is he going to do the same thing? Oh no, he like, just died. Anyways. <laughs> Alright, I killed your boss. You killed your boss. You mean he's out of the picture. I'd advise you not to hang around too long. Now how about getting me into the labs? Well, okay. Sure, it doesn't matter to me. The code to the elevator is 6512. Now make sure you have access once you get to the lab. 6512. 6512. Is that okay with the. 6512. Now, I guess. <laughs> you never know when you get. I love that in games. You get in the elevator. And you're supposed to know if you're going up or down. I don't know. Pacific Rim Research Facility? <laughs> I, I, I killed your boss. <laughs> uh, I'll take a break right here. I think this is the best because this is a quite a big facility here. Oh, this is the place in the intro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're the one that just cleared for level one. Yeah, that's me. You are welcome to stroll around the laboratories, <laughs> but respect the work that we do here. Your security pass can be cancelled with no warning. I've looked forward to this for a long time. Security is watching through the cameras. If you cause trouble, an alarm will sound, and the guards won't wait to ask questions. Yes, sir. I'll try not to get in anyone's way. Do not ask the scientists questions. They are very busy. They're very busy. The Americans are here, so everyone has to be a little more formal today. Yeah, let's stay here a while. Man, I saved a bunch of times. <laughs> that was awesome, right? Okay, so I'll take a little break here, come back in the... Yeah, we're in China. I'll be back in a couple of minutes. Not too long, like two or three minutes.
This is awesome. How does it work? They don't let me talk to lab personnel. Oh, why am lab personnel? Oh yeah, this. Hello. You shouldn't be back here. Is it okay? Check it out. I am the ultimate badass. Yeah. State of the badass art. You do not want to fuck with me. Thanks for the host. or almost never use that like I'm about halfway through the game and I never use an, any multi-tool well I, I've used some but this is the armor it's rare <gasps> oh, what's this <gasps> that's a ballistic armor I think so do I need anything in there I don't think so why do you need a weapon why do you need a weapon it's really a question of abstraction Exactly, exactly. You can't be dealing with this sort of thing on the base pair level. Essentially what I told Miss Chow. Tissue augmentation. It's not a matter of twiddling bits. We need to stay focused on tools. In principle, yes, I agree. The older scientists don't grasp what it means to have so much data. Still, we have to throw them a bone once in a while. With the right software, organism design should be indistinguishable from cat cam. We'll rip up another non-Mendelian. They love the Karkians. We are having an important discussion. You met the American team? Have a look around. The project is finally starting to heat up. Those two accents here. I don't know what accent that is. That's supposed to be French accent, I guess. We are having an important discussion. Oh my god. We are having an important... Just talking shop? Never mind <clears throat> us. It is a simple request. Lab procedure forbids. The psionics laboratory. The psionics laboratory has no business worrying about weak interactions between incidental subatomic particles. Our work on Fityov Capra. Capra. A quantum quack. Don't criticize what you don't understand. Exactly. Yeah, it is the... <laughs> the, the Hong Scientific Kong progress Park depends upon the, collaboration. Yes. Maybe you should cross your legs, unto yourself, and try to read my mind. The sharing of data between departments should be automatic. VersaLife did not achieve one trillion credit equity by disclosing R&D materials. We work in the same building. Our results can be understood only by a few dozen people on the planet, none of whom are psionics engineers. I'm not gonna act that. I don't need to. Uh, room. There's nothing in there. Okay. We can now descend into this. Go here also. As though people are interrupting each other. What would actually happen if the interrupted person just pause on their own? <laughs> uh, where am I going now? I can't remember where this is going. Is this where I have to go? Because I don't want to go where I have to go. Oh, hello. I don't recall being informed of any visitors. Oh, okay. 
Magnetic augmentation chamber. Ooh. As per our discussion, I will retain root access regarding the other key members of the weapon research team. M. Chao should be given full access, while the others will be granted only user access until further notice. By the way, hacking in this game, computer skill is uh, OP. Uh, gets rid of cameras and turrets. It's, it's, it's extremely useful. You can hack computers, gives you info, so if you like lore and stuff like that, it's like in this indispensable. <clears throat> well, I guess I had to go there. Everyone talks of each other all the time. <laughs> the hacking, yes. It is a staple. But <laughs> this is the first game, so it wasn't a staple until this game. But it's still OP. I mean, the objective of this game is you can play it however you want. You don't have to. Uh, like they make a point in the human revolution there's a mini game around that that hacking is really like important which you don't have to hack i've played human revolution all the way uh, gun it was really awesome it's a great game by the way uh, if you want to play uh, a, a deep uh, tactical shooter i'd say With all sorts of augmentation it's really a fun game it's a different experience that's what's fun with this game <clears throat> it doesn't look like it but you you can really play it however you want right now I'm playing I think is the best way um, like shooting the guys that I need to shoot not being too chaotic because chaos means um, people will will be alerted and this is kind of like a thief game where if two or three per people are attacking you at the same time, you won't last very long. It's not super realistic. You are a, a man machine, but uh, you won't last that long. Am I okay here? People the wrong recording me? should be in this wing of the laboratory. Yes, people are okay for now. Level two. We won't go to level two here first. I remember having a lot of... Uh, there's ventilation shafts here. I think that stealth is a, a staple of this, of, this, of this series. The game is kind of, especially this game, uh, it doesn't say it. Well, at the beginning, they're like, you should use non-lethal, you should be blah blah blah. But the firing aspect is all there if you want to use it. But I feel the game is really meant for you to be as stealthy as you can, but when shit hits the fan, well, you don't have any choice but to shoot. Because if I look at my, my ammo here, I only have two clips. Like I've engaged a little bit, but uh, you can't have too many clips of all the guns. You can't have that many guns here. So, uh, what is this? Again, this is super important. If I didn't have that, I would have to find the, the name and password somewhere. Oh, there we go. Fire shipment. Okay. Shit. Oh shit, there's so much stuff here. Wow. <clears throat> No, I want the password. I'll come back. I have uploaded the component the triads need to complete the sword. Go to the oh, next to the okay. I will bring 
Uh, we won't do that first. We will explore the thing before. Renaming the channel? Maybe? Uh, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Clearly, I don't know what I'm doing. When I made Retro Gaming Junction, it was just a YouTube channel where I made the SNES Chronicles and sometime I streamed a couple of times. And I was really in the mood of... Uh, of branding my channel, like I thought that like branding my, which is a good thing I think, but it's not the approach I want to take now, ever. Ah, oh, we don't have access to this. Oh, do we not return here? I think we come back here. <clears throat> think we have to <laughs> well, I'll just check my codes quickly uh, success it's not that it's not here five two five Wow oh is it the zero six two eight eight? Six two eight eight. Yeah. Hello. Oh no no no! We can access more stuff here. Okay. Holy shit. Oh my god. We want some stuff. Labs are down the hall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's it. That's it. <laughs> Nothing. Ah. I think you're lost. Oh, am I? I think you're lost. Like that? Okay, fuck it. Continuing. Return to where you belong. The process is going smoothly. Then. Oh, Rob Page. Better than we expected. The array of reaction modules has allowed the UC to perform multiple constructions in parallel. Wonderful. We'll have to try that trick at Area 51. The problem, you understand, is primarily a security concern. Never mind that punk from you, Natco. The security here is adequate and we have a long-term program guaranteed to make him irrelevant. We call it Icarus. Icarus? A sweet bit of engineering. You'll like it, but we can't talk here. Your office? No time. Tell me on the way. Uh, 
nothing to say? <coughs> you sound healed. I don't recall being informed of any visitors. No. Three picks for nothing. Oh no, there's multi tools in there. Oh, I want this. I have the code. For if there were just some way of tracking all these people. Ah, I thought it was 525. What the code then? Well, oh, that will cascade. Okay, that will destroy everything. I should. Oh, I have the key for that. Yeah. Something's not right here. <laughs> it's, it's, can I can I go there? God. Oh. oh, okay, 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 okay. Can I pick them up? God. No. I, God. I still have to open. Okay. I still have to open these things. Something's not right here. Just break the glass. God. Oh, how do you open this? God. Ah, oh, there's another code. Oh. Oh, another five letter code or four tools. Well, I mean, trying out new coat proteins that resemble common fossil lipids. I am not allowed to speak to visitors. Okay, we're gonna snoop around. Ah. Computer terminal is gonna do everything. Right? Yep. Yeah. Shut down, open, 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 email. Ciao. So much information. There's so much background. This game is just filled with lore and it, the world feels alive. You want to understand why they have grizzles, like the little raptor. It's explained somewhere, the black helicopter is explained, your nano augmentations are explained, everything's explained, the characters that have motivations. That apparatus in the center is for magnetic containers, kind of like a tokamak. Just crazy. Let's pick them up. Ah, oh, I need to use them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I have two words for whomever wrote this biometrics so, package. Yeah, yeah. User interface. User interface, yes indeed. User interface is really important. And I think this game has a great user interface. Uh, <laughs> here we have the eyes. Uh, we can install the Slight increase in accuracy and general target information. I never use that. Um, this is vision enhancement, which is quite useful because uh, tech 3 and 4 you can see uh, through walls. So I will install that and I think I'll even maybe upgrade it. I have to concentrate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody's going to have to totally gut this thing oh, and nice. start one over. That I don't have. Sometimes they give you a redundant one. So that's radar transparency or cloak. Not the same. Radar transparency is for mechanical stuff. 
butt cameras and turrets. And this is for guys. But I assure you this is this is better. Guys can be easily taken down. So I'm gonna use that. Radar transparency. Which I don't use that often, but it can be useful. How do they expect to express a high-level feature in a genome if they can't even come up with a topologically sound representation? And we already have these two. That's enough. I really must work. So, upgrading... Now we have night vision. Which looks like F8. Okay, F8. Oof. That's uh, enough. I really must work. That's not great. Uh, is it always a little small window like that? Ah. Uh. That's enough. I really and must active work. light and active. Oh, I can see through wall. No, I well, I kinda. <laughs> Is it a glitch? Or... It's not supposed to, but I can kinda. like it that much. So that new name are you thinking of old school junction? That's enough. I really no, must work. It would be like Camille or something. Oh yeah, Lupitu, to Lou. You never did the really stealth. Uh, That's enough. I this really game. must work. It's not that hard. I want to, like, this was just for fun, and it's been a while, so I'm. Some of the levels I can't remember that much, but That's I enough. want to come really back to this work. game and do two sorts of playthrough. That's why the DMGX or the mod might is pretty much on the back burner for now because I like to play a playthrough where I do it um, non-lethal completely non-lethal all the way do not kill anyone I really must work. and I think it's possible for there's only one guy you have to kill uh, well there's a couple of other but I, I would say like using kill switch instead of battling That's some enough. of the guys I really must work. and doing like Kind of not legal. Um, and another playthrough where I would go just gun blazing. That's enough. Because I, I did really that once. Work. It was really fun. <laughs> Try maybe to kill everyone in the game. <laughs> A crew device not very secure. Self replication is handled downstairs. Uh, so now it's upgraded, right? No, it's not. Do I upgrade it? What's the last one that I'm missing? I think it's like the heart or something like that. Yeah, I should upgrade it. I'll, I'll get more of these, do not worry. Cam Cam Camilio. <coughs> There's kind of a problem with, with that, <laughs> with the Camilio thing, is I have an old Twitch account that I should have used when I started streaming, but I didn't. I 
created another account and the retro gaming junction name because that back then I wanted to try streaming on YouTube, Twitch and Mixer at the same time. You look lost. Which I wouldn't really really recommend to anyone doing. I know many people do. Oh where is that leading me? Oh there's so many stuff here to explore. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's see. So yeah, I have another account that's named Camilio. <laughs> so uh, that's kind of a problem. So I can't take the name, it's already taken. And I can remove... Oh. I could change my name, like remove it from the... the reserve name, but... It takes a while. Wow. It's complicated. I think I would have to contact uh, somebody at Twitch, which I don't want to do. <laughs> I'll do it if I have to. I don't know. Like I said, I, I'm not sure if I want to change the name. If people like Virtual Gaming Junction, I, I just feel that it's not like me. And Twitch people are themselves, they're their user. off well see you soon Lepu I'm gonna I'm gonna call you Lepu 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 I don't know I don't know how to say your name Did I miss another junction there's so many it's a maze of air ducks here I feel like I missed a bunch Yeah, next day they're playing Omicron on GOG. I saw that. <laughs> I don't know who's playing it. Well, I, I, it's um, I'm following it. It's what's his name? Anyways, eh, I'm sure he saw you playing. <laughs> or maybe it's a request from GOG. That game needs traction. It's not that great. But another game that needs traction is uh, is an Acronox, but I, I hope you'll be playing soon. Love that game. Camino Retro. I don't know. Emilio underscore junction underscore RJJ RGJ Okay, so I did everything or did I do that here? Uh, maybe not What's this? Oh wow. Holy shit. Uh, no, I don't want to come back here. Oh, 
Okay. Uh, let me go back here. Oh. Okay. Ouch. Whatever. Oh. Ouch. I like that. It. <laughs> I really like that. <laughs> Can I steal that? I hope it's not taken. <laughs> it kind of rolls off the tongue. I was looking up a review for it and it brought me to your YouTube channel. Yeah, yeah, I didn't respond to it because I wanted to tell you about it like uh, like this. Uh, but yeah, you, you should really play it. It's one of my favorite games. Uh, as an RPG, like as the traditional kind of JRPG style game, uh, it's, it's emotional. You should take your time with it. The music, the characters, it's it can be a frustrating game. There's kind of some adventure aspect of it. Almost point and click, but there's no point and click. But you have to uh, find some stuff, talk to people, do some investigating. But it's all great, it's all good, it's all good. So, what is this? God! Oh, great. What the hell? Oh, whatever. Ah, uh, can I go down without getting myself hurt? Uh, with F7, maybe? Oh! Whatever. There's a bunch of med medical bots here. Uh, so I can't go to level 2, because I... Ah, oh, the glowing is nice. Um, I don't think I'm finished with exploring this here. Before everything goes to hell, because are you ready? Soon this will be crazy. But I think I'll just go straight to the door, there's no reason to linger here. Uh, okay, yeah. I wanna explore all this. Oh, a lockpick, I, I missed that. Oh, I just finished supervising the refit of the super freighter fuel tank to the tra transport the virus. This stuff should really be shipped in suspension crates. We're rapidly offloading. Blah 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 blah. Oh, aliens! I'm afraid we don't have time for visitors right now. Aliens! Raise. Yeah, yeah, thank you very much. Oh, I did get, get hurt. <laughs> Please, you upset the subject. Okay. Radioactive. Radioactive. Oh, yeah, this. God! God! There's nothing here except a couple of grays. It killed me in one shot. If there were just some way of tracking all these people. Clipped. My work is done here. What did you clip? I'm afraid we don't have time for visitors right now. What did you clip? <clears throat> Somehow tend to play a lot, but that's a good one. On your YouTubes? Yeah, I know, I know you saw me on you know, my YouTubes. I have a YouTube channel, by the way. Uh, if somebody is looking at this or don't have, doesn't have time to watch my old... Because uh, I know some of you watch the, the VODs on Twitch, uh, you can definitely watch, and I would... Uh, 
I would uh, recommend going on YouTube. Uh, I usually take about like three to f three four days, sometimes a week, uh, <laughs> before going to uh, upload them on YouTube. Um, but eventually, it, it 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 eventually ends up on YouTube. I can do that, but I think I did this right. Yeah, this is the old. Uh, Okay, so I think that's it. We're good to uh, come back here. I'm just gonna be sure, but yeah, I think that's it. Okay. So. That's why they put it at the entrance, because you start here. You can just go there, pick up the. Well, not pick up the sword, you upload or you download the ROM thing, I don't know. You do a job for a guy uh, because he saved your life, essentially. This is just a favor you're doing right now. This is not uh, necessarily to advance uh, your mission. Uh, uncovering the secrets of the world. Saving the world, essentially, from itself. <laughs> we are the Deus Ex Mach Machina. Oh wait, before this, I'm going to do a, a hard save. Oh shit. I'm sure I have the password somewhere. Do you have a podcast? No. <laughs> I don't. I wanted, when I started this whole thing, uh, not really the, the streaming, but my YouTube channel. Because I don't know why. I don't know why, I'm dumb or something. I'm clearly dumb, that's... <laughs> I think we have to... We don't have to discuss that. I'm clearly dumb. Because when I started my YouTube channel, I wasn't into streaming. I watched people stream, and I watched Let's Plays and stuff like that. Well, a couple of people, because I didn't know. Uh, now I know you guys. Uh, but I didn't know, I just didn't. I didn't know that streaming games like Deus Ex was a thing, or point and click adventures, or uh, dungeon crawlers, or old RPGs and stuff like that. I really didn't. I thought it was like speedrunners and newer games. Uh, yeah. At least 2000 and up. But no, people don't really care. There's really people that want to watch well I want to but I, I always think that I'm like alone in the world <laughs> like when I was young and I, I love these kind of games like Anachronox and Omicron and all this shit I felt all alone but now because of the internet I can discover I that I am definitely not alone the triads need to love to those kind of things sword. go to the temple next to the market I will bring together the dragon heads for a meeting because even, even though I'm not into uh, looking at speedrunners, it is looking at speedrunners that uh, opened up my eyes to watching people play games and how much I love watching the reaction of people playing games and learning through them, through their experience but also their knowledge of the, of the game. So I just have to go here, no, 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 we have to go up. Okay, this is started, but they don't know where I am, right? If I make no sound. We're good. We're good to go. Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. I wanted to create a beat here. So I know I wanted to like do something on, on the internet, like uh, show the world the, the games that I know and cool games that people not, might not know about. And I'm a big fan of the Super Nintendo, so I decided to start SNES Chronicles. So if you don't know, you can check my YouTube channel, but SNES Chronicles is pretty much dead. Uh, I don't think I'll ever uh, finish that. So... But I started streaming... Like, I had two channels 
I still have two channels. I have the French channel. I don't upload anything on that anymore. But I started streaming in French because uh, I thought that playing, looking at the chat, talking in, in English and everything would be uh, too difficult or just too much. But and I would do. I would just do it for my friends at that moment in time. Streaming in French. Oh, I'm kind of done because. <laughs> This guy will want to kill me. Uh, Sergeant! Oh, oh shit. That hell? That's the one. Okay. Oh, there you go. That's him. <laughs> oh my god. But I did do a hard saving right here. I'm telling you the history of the channel, by the way, <laughs> kind of. Eh, okay. Uh, let's just run with... I think they won't see me with that. They will hear my foot, though. With that, I'll go even faster, so... Woohoo! Sergeant, it's dead. Very close. I said, like, very close. Ah, oh, god damn it. When you want it to close, it never closes. Can I just use all my energy. We're going up. Woo! Uh oh. Oh, this is fine. We're fine. We're fine! What is it? Just Justin TV? Yeah, back then. Yeah, yeah. I watched um, Speed Demo Archives. It was called, and I think it was like their first. It was essentially uh, Games Done Quick before it was named Games Done Quick. It was literally a bunch of guys in an hotel room because whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, whoop. God. Ah. Oh, my ammo! <laughs> Man, you provoke me. Okay. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I want you to pick up that. Weapon modification. Draw. 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 Oh, that's not even a password. Should only enters with empty briefcase. Verify content of briefcase upon departure to ensure confidential protocols. Transmit enters without signing a note and display the recurrence increase. That's me. Louis <laughs> Elban engaged in anti conversation with research. Oh no. Another individual enter may possibly match the description of Jason Enter. Oh shit. So I guess he didn't see me. He was going downstairs and the sound of his clicking of the gun is like your indication that he's uh, hostile. And in this game you don't have like a big red whoop or something above the heads like an assassin creed or shit like that. It's all in the sounds and um, yeah. There's a HUD but it makes sense because you have augmentation in your eyes and stuff like that. So he was just going around and with a click click and he was looking at her like, oh, because <clears throat> the way it, the AI works in this game is they go around and when they see something that's weird, they just stop and go like, usually with the click of the gun, like click, and they're ready to shoot. And there's about three or five seconds, kind of like a camera, 
Yeah, they kind of went with the camera that goes beep, 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 beep. And if you stay there or if you continue to be a dumbass, well, they're, they're, they're gonna shoot you or they're gonna see you eventually. And that time might be longer, I guess, if, you, uh, if you're in shadows or if the things are that he's looking at, because it's not necessarily you, it might be bodies. Uh, no, there wasn't anything else. Uh, yeah, clip size. It's, it's really big now, the clip size. <laughs> that thing. So big that it's all. It enters all in one clip, 42 one clip. I. Yeah, I have no clips for that now. I need ammo. I'm full of lockpicks. charge because I really need to ah uh, this is where the temple well you are here observe yeah, the this laws is of the triad uh, yeah this is where you get the two of them it is decided oh I there thought it was there a truth. we saw him explode let us be quiet agent Denton from America has retrieved the software component please accept our gratitude it is my honor begin as the faces of a perfect breed are reflections of one another as they join together to make a perfect edge so we shall form one blade not the male and female swords of ganjiang one which must avenge the other but one weapon precise in its purpose though wielded by many arms and much as the steel sharpens its edge and anneals its own surfaces let us preserve together the form of our traditions the only enduring work of man that which is born again with the next generation forever forever again accept our thanks mr denton you will have to join us for drinks at the lucky money later tonight in the meantime mr tong wants to see you thanks for the offer maybe i'll stop by all right get out Enough games in it. Come, join us for drinks at the Lucky Money. We must celebrate! Tracer Tong will want to congratulate you. Mm -hmm. I cannot believe the news. The trial are won? I'm glad you go. Please accept the gratitude of the Luminous Path. is now official good we begin to operate from a position of strength we will start manufacturing the swords and distributing them to our allies what next Versalife was crawling with troops I think they were hiding more than sword technology down there tell me about the labs Paul and I concluded that Versalife does the manufacturing while the real research takes place in North America plenty of scientists biotech physics nanotech several research divisions it would seem we still have a mutual interest. We know they manufacture Ambrosia. If you went back and gained access to the level two labs, perhaps you would find something on the Great Death. Your brother's failure in New York has left me with nothing. You think you could find a cure? That cannot be determined until I have a schematic of the virus particle and the molecular structure of Ambrosia. I'll go back, but won't they be ready for me? There's a back way at the north end of the Canal Road Tunnel, which is just east of the temple. I sent an agent in that way once. 
She turned up a key code to the nanotech research wing, 55655, but no data. Worth a try. By the way, VersaLife lost one of their R&D men in the Canal Road tunnel collapse. A guy we think was carrying nanotech assets. He did some of the basic research that went into your implants. You might take a look, if you don't mind going for a dive. Maybe I'll check it out. Ah, uh, you should say I already did that. Usually they they account for that. And he has a cool It says like, yeah, I did that. Hmm. Paul must not be dead. They would have mentioned something. I've been checking out the schematics you found. That's one hell of a sword. Don't come, mate. You saw your friend Alex. He will stay with us. Charge bot. Oh yeah. Oh, so you have to go through the canal via dragon heads and the lucky money for dreams. Oh, we can do that. Secondary objective. Uh, do it. Uh, I cannot believe the news. The trial I won. The trial. What? still here. Yeah. <laughs> Give me some bullets. Oh shit. I could stop it. Where is the... Red Arrow will have to turn in security. So some people survived and some died. They say there is a German-speaking man looking for you. He smashed up a bar in one child. We are in your A German-speaking guy. Oh, that's Gunther. Now and the police cannot us. take sides. This one mirrors. 
Yeah, you couldn't just pass here and go. Uh, now I can pass here and go here, right? Uh, I guess they were upstairs taking tricks. No. At last, we are one triad. My good friend, let me express my gratitude. A bottle of wine on me. Yum sing. Thanks. I won't fail. Oh, <laughs> I wanted to win. <laughs> the lieutenant, we had to go through the precinct sergeant. I drank it. A cordial relationship, as I was. I wanted to throw it in space. You had him in your back pocket all the time. Only one of many important officials loyal to the Red Arrow. This is my club. Let me give you one of our better wines. An imported vin. <laughs> and do you have the capacity for Raj shipments? Let us drink in your honor. Your operations must have been difficult without official protection. A minor inconvenience. Not as difficult as you must have found running a business without distribution. <laughs> Not even noticeable. The Red Arrow makes many big deals. I will show you what big is. 50 tons per month. With no help from the big officials. But if you want a truly excellent wine, you should... <laughs> the peace you have created between our two triads is a truly <laughs> precious gift. Please accept our finest vintage, a Chianti. Pong's mission can wait. Rest for now. You the surprise. Enjoy yourself. You are my guest at the Rocky Man. A trifle. Don't let us drink Rocky in your... Man. Your name will be recorded for all time in the annals of the Luminous Path. Let us drink in your honor. A trifle. Don't mention it. Oh, sure. I don't mind me. Is there the German... Russian guy is upstairs? Still... You spilled my They pay the police, but no, the police come anyway. They shoot and I run, and I spill my drink all over my uniform. <laughs> I've won my money back. Why do you bother me? Evgeny was the one. He got us all to come and waste our time. Hey, what a mess. A filthy mess. Evgeny was the one. He got us all to come and waste our time. Hey, Evgeny! What a mess! Yevgeny. A filthy Where mess! Yevgeny! <laughs> okay, so we'll have to get back into Versalite by the, the canal. Uh, but I, I don't want to get back into Versalite right now. Who are you? Good evening! That would be too intense. That'll take a while, another big mission. And then we're off of Hong Kong go somewhere else that's it for now thanks everyone for watching and uh, we will be back with some Deus Ex not tomorrow tomorrow will be Suiko then in two days so we are Tuesday Thursday Thursday Deus Ex the schedule should be uh, just below the, this video and uh, you can also find it like on discord or uh, Twitter and so Suiko then tomorrow 8 p.m. Eastern time, then Deus Ex, then Suiko then, then Deus Ex, then Suiko then. <laughs> Until I finish one of these games. Uh, we're going Thanks to for getting me raid in. someone. Oh, I just out time. I'm sure the game will just crash on me. Oh my god. Ah, got them.
bye 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 DSX okay we will rain Follow at least. Oh, we'll play. Uh, we'll. Uh, oh. Yeah, we'll raid the uh, Mr. Uh, Busy Plasma. He's playing some uh, Half Life uh, Opposing Force. Later, Scott Ski. Later, Space. Later, Nix. Wuchak. Yeah. Half Life Opposing Force and the Source Engine, I think. He was playing Half Life on the Half Life Source. So, remember to have fun, guys. Peace.